As I'm inching closer and closer to my goal of visiting every country, I feel like it's necessary to discuss the question of all questions. How many countries are there in the world? It's one of the most debated topics among travelers, and to be honest, there is no definite answer. The Olympics has 206 members, FIFA has 211 teams, and the Traveler's Century Club recognizes 327 unique countries and territories. But the list that I personally go by is the United Nations list, which currently sits at 193 countries. I realize that there is a gray area for many unique territories, most notably the Vatican, Kosovo, Taiwan, and Palestine. All four are not included in the UN's list, yet they are self-governed with their own authorities. They have their own national flag, passport, currency, and most importantly, they have diplomatic recognition of sovereignty from most other nations. Do I think the Vatican, Kosovo, Taiwan, and Palestine are countries? Well, yes, and I've been to all four, but I cannot include them in my official list, because if I do, then what about Kurdistan, Somaliland, Western Sahara, Northern Cyprus, Transnistria, Guam, the Falklands, Tahiti, Tibet, Hong Kong, and Macau? They too Two are all self-governing with their own passport, currency, and flag. How many generation Falklander are you? I'm a native. What? This is my country. I don't belong anywhere else. And then you have the next tier of places, like Greenland, which is technically owned by Denmark, but has little in common with them except for cold weather. Likewise, French Guyana is owned by France, but it's 7,000 kilometers away. How can they be treated as the same country? And what about the United Kingdom? If you ask anyone from Wales, they will tell you that it's a country. Same story with Scotland, Northern Ireland, and England. While they each have a very strong argument, I simply cannot include them in my country count or else the list will keep growing and growing and growing. Of course, I want to visit every place, but I need to make restrictions. So for me, the number sits at 193, and as far as I know it, there have been less than 90 people in recorded history to have visited them all. I'm hoping to be one of the next in about two years from now. I'm Drew Binsky, and if you like my travel videos, please click subscribe and join me as I plan to visit every country in the world.